De Bruyne is now fourth choice as the Premier League champions captain, with Manchester City boss Pep Guardiola allowing his players to choose their own skipper through a vote. Kevin De Bruyne has dropped to fourth choice as Manchester City captain following a vote by Pep Guardiola's players. De Bruyne was vice-captain for the 2020-21 season, and often wore the armband with club skipper Fernandino not always a first-team starter. City boss Guardiola has allowed his players and staff to choose their captain since club legend Vincent Kompany departed two years ago. And after the latest vote, Ilkay Gundogan is now vice-captain to Fernandino, ahead of Ruben Diaz. Who is third choice and wore the armband against RB Leipzig in the Champions League on Wednesday night. That means De Bruyne is now fourth choice, according to the Sun the Belgian playmaker has been a huge player for City since joining from Wolfsburg for £68. Four million in 2015, having helped a club to three Premier League titles, five League Cups and one FA Cup. But two of his last three campaigns have been disrupted by injuries, while Gundogan and Diaz having been among City's standout players last season. De Bruyne was in fine form during the 6-3 win over Leipzig, firing in the delivery that led to Nordi Mukiele's calamitous own goal that doubled City's lead. Raheem Sterling was not voted into City's leadership group, having been third choice last season. Sterling lost his left-wing spot to Phil Foden during the second half of the campaign. Although he returned to the starting lineup for the Champions League final defeat to Chelsea. The 26-year-old has since starred for England in Euro 2020 and the recent World Cup qualifiers. And has been involved in every City game so far this season, although has only made one start. Meanwhile, Nathan Arke made an emotional tribute to his dad, who died minutes after the defender scored his first Champions League goal. Arke netted City's opener in their 6-3 win over Leipzig at the Etihad, heading home across from Jack Grealish's corner. It later emerged that his father had passed away minutes later after an illness, Arke wrote on Instagram, The past few weeks have been the toughest of my life, my dad has been very ill and there was no more treatment possible. I was lucky to have a lot of support from my fiancé, family and friends, yesterday after a difficult time I scored my first Champions League goal. And only a few minutes after he passed away peacefully with my mum and brother by his side. Maybe it was meant to be, watching me play always made him proud and happy, I know you're always with me, you will always be in my heart and this one was for you dad. Quote.